Hi beautiful friends, do you want to be so golden like Harry Styles sings about, you're so golden? <laughs> but when you're over 40, you have some certain issues, age spots, spider veins, that makes finding the perfect self tanner difficult because we want to cover those things. Well today's video, I am sharing with you my four favorite self tanners that address all the needs of ladies like me, 52 or over 40 and up to get your best golden on. What kind of issues do ladies like us over 40 have when we want to be golden brown? We want that California tan. Well, most of us realize that back in the 80s and 90s, we baked in tanning beds and out in the sun with baby oil and all we did was damage our skin and cause premature aging. I am absolutely guilty. I lived in tanning beds. We all love a good tan. It feels good. It looks pretty. I have suffered from five skin cancers as a result and terrible age spots. Now, I have been working on getting rid of some of those age spots and some of my techniques have been successful. So if that's something you're interested in, when you get done with this video, head over to my playlist, look for beauty, and I have a couple different videos, how to get rid of age spots and TCA pills. But that's a conversation for a different day. So today we're looking for self tanners because if you're like me, we have realized if we have the age spots, if we put most self tanners on, they just make the age spots look darker. What the heck? I even bought a tanning machine. Yes, my husband will spray tan me from time to time. What I did love about it was it would settle in those brown spots and make them look worse. So if you take a a look at my bathroom drawer. This is my tanning drawer. These are some of the products I have tried. I haven't tried them all, but I've been through a lot. If you've tried some that you like and that have worked, put in the comments and I will do a video on it. I will try it out. But I'm going to share with you today what has worked for me. Number one, I so far and I'm on an endless quest. This is why I'm here, to help us find beauty, fashion, motivation tips for those of us over 40. But so far, I've only found two products that completely hide my sunspots, brown spots, spider veins when you're talking about sunless tanner type products. Number one, may surprise you, may or may not, is Sally Hansen Airbrush Leg Spray. I use this all over my legs. I've used it all over my entire body. This is like airbrushing. It does not enhance the brown spots. It covers them. It's like you've had primer and paint. It hides them. So this is a great go-to. I recommended this not too long ago to somebody going to a wedding. You don't have time to get a selfless tan. You're worried about the brown spots. You have spider veins. This, you can spray all over your body. It is a perfect solution. You're gonna look golden tan. You just have to find the right color for you and they come in a multitude of colors. Downside to this, it's messy. I would recommend either spraying outside if you have a private area in your backyard on some cardboard, spray it outside. I spray it in my shower. It will get everywhere in your bathroom if you just spray it like standing in a bathtub. But if you have a shower that you can enclose in, you're just gonna have to clean it after you dry off, after your sun, after your tan dries. And I use scrubbing bubbles and it gets rid of it completely. But if you use this all the time, it does get quite messy. I have found that it does not stain my clothes. Yes, like many self tanners, it's gonna leave a little bit of tan residue on the inside of some of your clothes, especially if they're white, but mine have always washed out. So this is my ride or die. If I have a wedding to go to, this is what I spray. It's inexpensive for just one time, works fantastic. Secondly, my top product for covering my age spots, and I have talked about this in other videos, is a product that I found this year that I don't know how I can live without. 
<laughs> this is called Westmore Beauty Body Camouflage. This is a cream. I'll take it off and show you here. I've actually done a TikTok on this that went pretty well. I, I can't remember 15, 25,000 views. People really, really liked this because it shows how it covers my brown spots. You cannot see them. I wear this almost constantly. I put it on my neck and my chest. I have a lot of sun damage, probably the most sun damage on my body, neck and chest. I have a condition called poikiloderma on my neck where sun damage has made little blood vessels show. If you're looking super close, it has that little chicken bump skin. I hate it. And then down here is all my brown spots. This covers it completely. Great thing about it, it lasts two to three days. I kid you not. Downside to it, it dries a little bit dry. So it's gonna cover you completely. It's gonna look great, but after day two or three, it starts to feel a little chalky and you might have to add some kind of moisturizer to it. But you have to be careful, you can't do oils. Oil is what takes this off. I use baby oil or olive oil, it, take it, all complete, it will take it completely off. I do a CeraVe lotion super light over this on day two or three. But this is my ride or die. It comes usually the, I should say flavors, you're not gonna lick it. <laughs> the different colors come in the suffix radiance. So there's fair radiance, natural radiance, golden radiance. I think there's another like bronze radiance. I've tried all four of those. I think there's a whole lot more gamut of colors. The one that works best for me is natural radiance. The fairest is fair fairest of all, then natural, which this one, I have it on right now on my neck. Um, golden radiance works really great for a tan. So you can use this all over your whole body. It is kind of expensive and time consuming if you're gonna put it all over your whole body, but it's waterproof. So I recently went snorkeling on my anniversary in the Keys and I put the bronze radiance all over my whole body. It lasted perfectly for the whole weekend even snorkeling. There was a little bit that came off snorkeling, but not much. So I was really impressed with it. So this will cover the age spots and the spider veins. Great, great deal. If you're just looking for a dark tan, I put on my legs, my very favorite self tanner, Loving Tan 2 Hour Express, and I wear the shade of medium. This is not gonna give you the coverage that Westmore Beauty or Sally Hansen is gonna give you, but this will give you a really dark, good tan, and I love it. It's a mousse. It has a color guide that looks like a tan, so when you put it on, you're immediately tan, and it looks like a real tan, and then over the next few hours, it will darken. You can shower if you want, and it will have the end result. I actually don't usually shower till that night. I swear by this stuff. It's so easy to put on. You can't hardly mess it up. It is a little more on the pricey side, but absolutely worth it to me. It will not cover your brown spots, spider veins, as well as the other two, but what I typically do is I use on a regular basis the Westmore Beauty on my neck and chest. I may dab a little bit um, on a spider vein, and then I put this all over the rest of my whole body. So this is my ride or die favorite general tanner. The other one that I am loving is CeraVe Hydrating Mineral Sunscreen. When I go for walks every morning, I usually wear a hat and I wear long sleeves because I am trying to protect my 52 year old skin to last as long as possible and not get any more skin cancers. This has a color to it. It's almost like foundation. Let me see if I can put that on here and show you. And this, it comes in, I think it just comes in the one tint. I could be wrong. I did hear some ladies griping about that on one of my skin groups. This one works perfect for me. So I use this as makeup some days if I don't feel like putting a lot of makeup on. I use it over my neck. As far as covering brown spots, I would say medium coverage. It's not gonna completely cover or airbrush like these two, but this is a good everyday go-to with 30 SPF. It's mineral, so it's healthy for your skin. And a lot of times I will just put this on 
over my neck or my face if I'm just going out really, really quickly. Absolutely fantastic. So that's it, guys. That is my four ride or die products for over 40 for selfless tans. I hope you found something you like today. I hope you'll try one. If you like today's video, please consider giving it a thumbs up. That really helps me as a YouTuber and consider subscribing. I am dedicated to spending the rest of my life making these videos, writing on my blog, interacting with you all on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok because I love to help women see that our life over 40 is beautiful and we can live the best life beautifully that we can. So let's share all our tips and tricks together. So think about subscribing and joining the community. All right, it's a beautiful sunny day. I'm getting ready to go out enjoy the day with my fake tan, <laughs> hiding my age spots, and just living life and not worrying about it because it makes me feel good. I hope you have a great golden day. I will see you every Sunday at 12 Central. I upload a new video and I hope to see you here. Thanks so much for watching That's So Trishy. Bye. A sun in. I talked about. Uh.